Hey guys, so today is a big day. I am preg checking Big Marie. Uh, she is 20 days post breeding, which means that tomorrow she would be going into standing heat. She is showing zero signs, no swelling of uh, the vulva, no redness, no discharge, nothing. So I thought that I'd give her a check. Uh, you can check technically as early as 18 days post breeding. If they do have a large litter, amniotic fluid can be detected. Um, but if you don't detect anything, it doesn't mean that she isn't pregnant. It just means that she doesn't have enough fluid to detect yet. So I'm going to get started. I have her eating and distracted. I have my Pregtome multi-species here. And I'm just going to flip the switch, turn it on. And you put some oil on your probe. A heavy oil, like vegetable oil, works great. And uh, you want to go on her right side in front of her rear leg and above her nipple. So once you hear some intermittent beeping, that's when you know that you have good contact. So with her, I've had to put a lot of oil on just to make good contact because she does have some hair. So that intermittent beeping, that means that you've made contact. When it changes to a solid tone, that's when it detects amniotic fluid. Now you have to be careful because it can detect any fluid, meaning the bladder. The bladder is towards the back, so you want to have your probe pointing towards her front shoulder. So you just keep moving around. You can hear it starting to change. So I'm just going to add some more oil to get better contact. You hear that? How it's changing? I'm calling that pregnant. That is solid tone. The probe is pointing up towards her front left shoulder. Her bladder's back here. No way it's picking up on that. She was, so was successfully bred uh, through artificial insemination, and based on the date that I inseminated her, we are looking at piglets February 2nd. So time for me to start getting my winter farrowing uh, plan in place and make sure that she is maintaining a proper diet so she can keep trimming down and losing weight so that she is in better shape uh, for farrowing. And hopefully we have a big litter of healthy piglets and a good mom in Big Marie. So stay tuned.